what sort of investment is required for starting own algo trading desk so uh, nilish that would depend on what kind of um, uh, desk you're talking uh, what kind of desk you're talking about if you're talking about a low frequency prop desk so where you are just pulling in your own capital for um, you know, for a low frequency uh, for a low frequency set of strategies in that case it won't be quite high it would it would it would be minimal in that case but uh, if you are talking about high frequency then it would be quite costly so it will it can range from uh, quite uh, obnoxious number which would be obnoxious for the individual traders uh, in epat we focus more on the low frequency and the medium frequency uh, ways of trading but uh, most of the faculties do have a very rich experience on the high frequency trading side uh, some of them are running uh, some of the leading firms in the high frequency trading domain so that's there so we do cover some aspects of it but um, more focus is given to uh, low frequency and uh, medium frequency so like uh, where you are not running after each and every microsecond to save each and every microsecond um of um, of latency so so that's there so few milliseconds or a few uh, 100 milliseconds of latency if your strategy can live with that then those kind of strategies generally will put uh, put under the under the low frequency domain and uh, those kind of strategies do get covered in in epat so so yeah so it does cover different kind of strategies but more focus on low and medium frequency